We're going to be the biggest and best this year. We're not going for a second rate war. We are going for the biggest <laughs> and the best. use this event to really reach out to the whole community. The hospice needs support, that's the bottom line and this is an easy way for people in the community to actually step out, raise a little bit of money in sponsorship and come and support us and if they can't walk they can still make a donation and help keep us uh, afloat, keep the hospice going so that care can be provided when it's most needed. Well the hospice is actually the main charity that Miss Northern Ireland sponsors every year so as one of the charity ambassadors it's been an amazing experience. I've launched um, various coffee mornings and I'm taking part in the 2011 hospice walk so I'm really looking forward to that. There's so many demands on people and no matter how much someone is willing or wanting to give, I mean, it's just, I mean, purse strings only go so far and obviously we think that this, because it is the most important charity, uh, you know, so this is why we have to go all out and, and try to encourage people. I would say that the charity is perhaps the most important thing of Miss Northern Ireland because it's what we want, we want to promote uh, the good work that the hospice does. Also with regards to Miss World, the main point there is beauty with a purpose where each person takes a charity and that's why we sponsor the hospice because it is such a great cause. The recession has hit us and uh, we have noticed uh, last year our funds were certainly significantly uh, uh, affected for the hospice walk in particular and we're very keen this year to really boost the numbers. We're looking for an extra 500 people to take part in the walk so this year we're looking for 3,000 walkers. We're sure we can do it but we do need the community behind us uh, stepping out, clubs, organisations, businesses, schools, church groups and individuals to step out for hospice.